The next proof is prove that the angle at the center is equal to two times the angle at the circumference. So this angle at the center, angle O, equal two times the angle at circumference, angle A. Okay. To do this, we have to start with a construction. So we're going to construct a line that passes through A and O. Now this line doesn't have to go all the way to the circumference, but you can if you want to. Now, we're going to be working in these two triangles just so that it's easier for me to reference the angles. I'm going to label this angle A1, A2, angle O1, and angle O2. Okay, so let's start there. Now, the first thing that you want to do is say, let angle B be equal to X. Now, look at this triangle, AOB. In that triangle, you have OB, which is a radius, and that is equal to line OA, which is also a radius. So we basically have an isosceles triangle, which must mean that angle A1 is also equal to X. So we'll say therefore A1 is also equal to X because we have angles opposite equal sides. Now if angle A1 is X and angle B is X, this exterior angle of the triangle will be equal to 2X. So angle O1 is therefore equal to 2X because you calculate an exterior angle of a triangle by adding the two interior angles. So X plus X give me the exterior angle of 2X. So angle O1 is equal to 2X, exterior angle of a triangle. Now, in the same way I did that for the one triangle, I'm going to do the exact same thing for the other triangle. But now I rather want to say, let angle C be equal to Y, because I've already used X. So let me use a different angle, Y. Then I also know that A2 is going to be Y, because we have these radii, OC is equal to OA, right? And then we also have the exterior angle here, which will be equal to 2Y, but these two Y's added together. Now, let's see what we have. Angle A is equal to X plus Y. Angle O is equal to 2X plus 2Y. If I factor out a 2 here, let's say I take out 2 as a common factor, then O is equal to 2 times X plus Y. But wait, we said that X plus Y is equal to angle A. So this must mean that angle O is equal to 2 times angle A. And hence, the angle at the center is equal to 2 times the angle at circumference.